Yo, Insanity Gaming and Music here. It's been a while. Um, I've been away. Well, not really. I, I tend to post a lot, and then I tend to settle down for a bit. I'm a little bit bipolar that way. But I just thought I'd pop back on because I just got my first cards graded from TCG, or um, TGA, rather. Um, the Grading Authority. And I'm pretty happy with them. The slabs look awesome. Um, let's take a look at this first. Blaine's Charizard only got a 3, and I'm not surprised because he has some, um, can't really see it too well in the slab or in this light, but he's got creases running across the back of him in three different places, and it's pretty, pretty well played with, um, so I'm not surprised he got a 3. A little disappointed, I was hoping for at least a 4, but it's cool, um, this guy right here, Vaporeon, EX, he got a... He got a 6, which is alright. You know, that's not too bad. I'm happy with that. I didn't expect him to even get that, really, because he had a little dimple in him somewhere around here. Um, so I'm happy with a 6. These slabs are nice and thin. Um, I suppose they're supposed to be. Uh, there's a little bit of a, um indentation in the back here that you can feel, which is probably to push that card forward, you know what I mean? Um, they will color coordinate your labels up here. Um, I screwed up. Well, I don't know. I didn't screw up, but, um, something happened. This Blaine's Charizard was supposed to be orange up here. Um, I don't know if it was a miscommunication to the company that I used to send these out, or if it was a miscommunication at the, um, at the grading authority itself. But, um, my, the way I sent mine out was I went to my local card shop, Coastal Cards, the guys I always deal with, and, um, I paid them 20 bucks a card and they actually drove them down to the grading authority for me um and a bunch of other people's too and um yeah he offered to go drive this back down for me and have it switched out to orange but i didn't want to wait another month so i said no nah, it's cool plus it's only a three so no big deal so i'm overall really happy um they also came with um these clear protectors on them so that the cases don't get scratched up. I don't know if my card company, if my card store did that for me or if they came from the grading authority that way. So my test that I want to do is after Christmas here, I want to take and I want to send this Leafeon and this Pikachu from 2007. Um, I want to send these two through my local game store. And then I want to send Espeon. Nah, I might send Espeon through my local game store. I'll send Espeon and the M Charman Char uh, M Charizard EX. I'll send these two through my local card store, and these two I'll just send on my own. And I'll see, you know, what the turnover rate is. See if these get back faster than these, um, where he drives them down, um, or if. You know, if in the mail it happens quicker, um, I'll see if they come with these protective sheets over the top, um, if I mail them, if they mail them back to me. Um, and, you know, we'll see what happens with these labels. Um, I'm very curious to find out. They're very accommodating, at least my card store was, and he makes these guys sound like they are too. So, that's going to be my little experiment. Um, those are my the grading authority cards, my first graded cards that I've ever ever gotten, I've ever had done. Um, I'm pretty excited. I'm going to get a bunch more done. Yeah, that's it, guys. Um, I hope you like my video. Please pay attention because I will be posting some more right off here. Peace.